Welcome to the special edition of WHHI News. I'm Allie McNair along with Lisa Richardson. We are glad to be here, aren't we, Lisa? We are. We are at the RBC Heritage presented by Boeing. And you know, this is a really special year because for the first time since 2019, we are able to have full capacity crowd, but also we have a really strong field here. We've got the top five uh, or five out of the top 10 players in the world here. Three players that are here this week were in contention at the Masters just last week. So it's pretty impressive. I'll say it is for sure. And also equally impressive, it's just the community spirit here. As you mentioned, uh, full crowd to this weekend. It's a place where people can come on the weekends with their families. It's a great place to see friends, to socialize, sure. network for your business, all kind of things. And of course, watch the great golf. And you know what else is you were talking to me before we started this today, the volunteers here are so critical. Um, Steve Wilmot, the uh, director of uh, the tournament, tournament director said, He's got over 1,400, or they do have over 1,400 volunteers. If they had to pay, RBC had to pay those volunteers even just a dollar an hour. By the time they would figure everything out, there'd be no money left to give um, from the Heritage Classic Foundation to all those wonderful nonprofits and charities that they do. So kudos to all the volunteers. And as you mentioned, when we said about community, this is a way that our local schools and beyond raise money for their programs by um, working concessions and serving the tournament. So it's definitely a great community support. It sure is. And and speaking of spectators and how it feels to be here, uh, John Farrell, the director of golf and sports here, said, you know, it's kind of like being at a ball game at Wrigley Field or at Fenway. I mean, there's nothing like it. You really feel a part of it. You feel that you're participating um, really different. We can get really close to the action and what's going on. You really can, especially um, talking about action, what's going on. Of course, it is golf and heritage, but it also is Easter week. A lot of families here on the island. And speaking of that, the heritage puts on a wonderful Easter service. It will be at the Liberty Oak at 7.30 a.m. on Sunday and it's open to the public. Anyone could come. It will feature a PGA Pro Jonathan Bird speaking a few uh, words that morning as well. But guess what? We're out of time for right now. We're going to send it over to Maria so you can find out about your weather. Maria? Thanks, Allie. All right, let's take a look at the weather for Saturday. So it looks like it's going to be cloudy in the morning with thunder showers in the afternoon and then going into the evening. Helena's going to have a high of 78, low of 63. Bluffton's going to have a high of 82, and a low of 65. And Beaver's going to have a high of 80, and a low of 63. The sunrise for this weekend is going to be at 6.53, and sunset's going to be at 7.53. Taking a look at the beach tides, Saturday high tide's going to be at 9.43 a.m. Low tide's going to be at 4.50 p.m. And then Sunday, high tide is going to be at 10.28 a.m. and low tide is going to be at 5.32 p.m. Taking a look at the next few days, Sunday is going to be mostly cloudy in the morning with thunder showers in the afternoon, highs in the 70s, lows in the 60s. Monday, showers and thunderstorms are highly likely and we're going to have highs in the 70s, lows in the 60s. And then Tuesday, it's going to be sunny all day in all three regions and we're going to have highs in the 70s and lows in the 50s. That's it for today. Have a great weekend. We will be back in just a moment with more of WHHI News from the RBC Heritage presented by Boeing. Hello, I'm Mayor John McCann. On behalf of the town of Hilton Head Island and all 40,000 residents, it is my pleasure to welcome you to our island for the 54th RBC Heritage presented by Boeing. We are proud to host this spectacular PGA tournament this week and share our island with each of you, golfers, fans, volunteers, visitors from all over the world. Along with our warm and rich hospitality, there is so much here for you to enjoy. Our natural and beautiful environment, arts and cultures, restaurants, miles of sandy beaches, parks and other recreation. We invite you to take advantage of everything our community has to offer. We want you to have a great time and a safe while being here, attending a tournament and visiting our community. Thank you for coming to Hilton Island. We hope you have an awesome day.